Joe is many things. He's incredibly hardworking and diligent, exceptionally creative and innovative. Approachable, accessible. He really is truly a, an amazing scholar, a teacher, a scientist. He's fully invested in his students and I, I feel really lucky to have worked with him. To me, Joe Fox embodies what the contemporary scholar schoolmaster is and really should be. I grew up in Northeast Philadelphia. I'm the youngest of seven children. My father was a piano mover. In high school and college, during summers, I would work, I would work on the trucks. I became interested in science, I think, as a fourth grader. I had a great teacher in fourth grade who helped me get inspired to, to start thinking about, about science and medicine. So I went to Princeton and basically as soon as I took organic chemistry, I was, I was hooked and started doing research right away. So I finished my PhD at Columbia in 1998 and then I went to MIT for postdoctoral studies and came to UD in 2001. Joe has been incredibly active and been a key player in the field of bioorthogonal chemistry. The chemistries that he develops and integrates in materials are truly unique and some of the fastest on the planet. The thing that we're most known for is developing a reaction called the tetrazine ligation. It's really uniquely powerful for being able to build molecules that are either attached to biological molecules or to even be able to build molecules within biological systems. So Joe has been incredibly dedicated to push education forward, to be more effective in, in the classroom, to be more modern in the teaching labs, and pairing that with an advocacy for the students. He's really dedicated to advancing science at UD and making UD a really great place to be a scientist. He thinks about ways to pay it forward and continue to make UD the, the wonderful place it is for, for us to work and to, to do science and engineering. I'll just say that I'm incredibly honored to receive the Francis Allison Award. It's a great honor, first of all, to be a faculty member at this university and to have so many wonderful colleagues at the University of Delaware. It's, it's, it's obviously a very esteemed group, so I am very honored to be part of it.